You are right to be worried about the broken communications array, Rodent. A potential client might contact us and find our messaging system unavailable. Our inbox has been dry for cycles, Drax. Perhaps because... Make it fast, Quill. I still got that array to repair. Can we talk for a second? Are we okay? Oh, tip-top, Captain. So that's a no. Why do you care? I'm just here to fix things, right? Who cares what I think? Rocket, please. Just because I don't always take your advice doesn't mean I don't listen to you. We're a team. Everybody's got an opinion. So you'd rather listen to Gamora? Gamora? Gamora knows her stuff, man. She's the navigator. She navigates the stars and, and planets and, uh, uh, comets. She navigates comets. Sometimes. And Groot is our, uh, special vegetation specialist. His opinion's valid, too. And Drax? What makes him so great? He's, uh, uh tactical. Tactics. The man is such a tactician. And then there's me. The guy who gets mad and starts shooting up the place instead of following the plan. Come on. You're a valued member of this team. We started this together. Now we need to make something profitable of it. Something lasting. We could go to nowhere like you suggested. But if we don't pay that fine, Nova Corps will come for us. How do we make money then? Maybe paying our fine makes some sense. Exactly. So let's just get it over with and move on, right? We'll see. There. Happy now? We done? I wonder what the future has in store for us. More fighting! Perhaps next time we should get a contract with no fighting involved. What would you be good for, then? Dispatching enemies is not my only skill. On it, and finished. I doubt even you could break that. Rocket, any chance you can check out the fridge while you're at it? I, I ain't got time to refill it. I got other priorities right now. Uh, penny for your thoughts? What is a penny? Uh, it's money. Like units? The saying means I'd pay to know what you're thinking. We must use our currency to pay the Nova Corps fine, or we risk... Drax. Just tell me what's up. I am realizing that I do not know as much as I thought I did. Our visit to Seknarf-9 was not what I expected. Because Lady Hellbender isn't a giant? She is definitely not. That is only part of it, Peter Quill. On our way to her fortress, I... Realize that many of my assumptions about this team have been incorrect as well. Really? The Assassin and the Rodent. Without them and the tree fighting nobly beside us, we would not be alive right now. I told you, they're not bad people just because they have a bad past. Life is... complicated, Drax. Things are never simple. On Katath, it was. I had a family that I cherished and a... Certainty about life that I no longer possess. I'm sure you'll find it again. Just give it some time. Rodent, will you have time to repair the broken refrigerator door? What? Like now? In the near future. I got a whole cons array to fix. And then I'm getting started on some weapons upgrades for the ship. I ain't got time for no fridge door. Get out of my tail, Quill. I'm busy.
Hey, Groot! Is the Chew Devil trying to chew on anything down there? I am Groot. Good. Keep it that way. Starting to think maybe it's just what it eats, you know? I am Groot. Yeah, the QZ would have been an open buffet for something that eats wires. I'm Groot. Oh, nice! You made a cute little pen. I am Groot. Yeah, it better stay out of my fur. <laughs> Whoa. Glad Corel didn't find that on top of the Space Llama. Nice. Is that one from Seknarf 9? I bet it loves water. You truly believe the llama creature consumes wiring as its diet? I don't know, maybe? Wouldn't be the strangest thing I've heard. There are numerous Katafian legends about metal-eating beasts, although they usually prefer to consume a warrior's blade, and usually right before an important battle. You didn't mean to chew up the comms, did you? <laughs> Tell me, Rodent. Would you have harmed the llama creature if the tree had not removed it? You think? That thing's got it coming. I would prefer if you refrained. I would prefer not to have to remove your arm. What the? Why do you care about that llama now? We have removed it from its natural habitat. Gamora, did you find... <gasps> Are those dolls? Yes. No. It doesn't matter. The Halos Hope's in the Teo system. Coordinates are in your console. So, why'd you close the view screen? None of your business. Isn't it, though? Sounds like you're trying to hide something from us. Yes, I am. Hate to disappoint, but I saw everything. Didn't really peg you as a doll collector. So what if I collect them? A lot of people have hobbies. Groot collects plants. Rocket's obsessed with bombs. Yeah, yeah, and Drax has a lot of really scary-looking knives. See? Nothing out of the ordinary. I guess. You know, as a kid, I collected stuff, too. Baseball cards, action figures... You think collections are childish? No, 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 uh, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I'm messing with you, Peter. I don't care what you think, I'd just rather keep my hobbies to myself. Okay, Corel, get ready to be impressed. Time's ticking away, Peter. Looks like your girlfriend held up her end of the bargain, Quill. We know for sure it's her. Checking. Same designation as before. It's definitely Hallis Hope. Ship's fine. Which part? Ask Quill. He's the one who keeps crashing. All right, let's pay that fine. Hmm. Good question. Hey, Gamora, you've been in a Nova Corps station. They got public restrooms. We have a toilet right here, Groot. Our bathroom is quite cramped for a being of his stature. He can bend. So, after we get out of here, 
You mean, if we get out of here? I know someone who could set us up with a relatively lucrative contract. I will not assassinate anyone. Yeah, I ain't sneaking around no rich Flarker's mansion to poison his dinner or something. I was going to explain how we could land a cattle herding contract with our llama experience. Absolutely not! Ready to pay our fine? I am Groot. Even Groot can see you're here for some blueberry pie. I bet Groot has a rich, velvety voice. I know there's some reason we're doing this, but I still want to go on record that I don't want to be here, and that being here is a mistake. You ever been to the Rock before? Yeah, looks like every other Novacor station. This reminds me of when I surrendered to the authorities. What was it like? Liberating. Okay, here we go. If they so much as scratched her paint, we get Novacor to reduce our fine. Good luck with that. It's gross negligence. Negligence. That's what I said. Where is everybody? Most Nova stations are heavily automated, all synchronized by the world mind. It is unsettling. Not like they had much choice after the war. Too many seats, not enough butts. Seems more efficient this way, anyway. Sure, till the world mind sneezes and sub- M shift. Designation Milano. Move to holding space R734 PL. Present validated ticket to kiosk prior to departure. Relax, Rocket. It's standard procedure. You keep saying that. This isn't exactly my first Novacore find. Yours either. First time I'm paying one. Flarkin knew I should have stayed on board. Coming, Rocket? Yeah, yeah. You know, it does seem kind of extra empty around here. Good. The fewer cops we gotta talk to, the better. Your suspicion of law enforcement is itself suspicious. Okay, it's not supposed to be this empty. Is it a holiday? Space cops don't take holidays. Hello? We're here to pay a fine? Looking for Centurion Corral? Door's locked. Well, we tried. Come on, let's go. We're not leaving. We'll go to them if we have to. Look, the door controls are on the other side if we can get you there. So what, now I'm supposed to hack Novacore security? I mean, if you don't think you can... Cheap shot, Quill. We are discussing breaking into a Novacore facility. It ain't breaking in if no one's here. That is precisely when one would break in. Perhaps this is a test, to see if we will respect the bureaucratic process. Well, newsflash, I don't. And if they want their money, they better hurry up and come and take it. You gold domes hear me? I got much better things to do with these units than forking them over to you! Perhaps we simply need to wait our turn. Highly doubt it. Yeah, Nova's tech ain't that fancy. Don't expect me to hijack the world mind or anything, but I can handle some low-level security. Alright, there's an air duct in here. Could be a way in, Rocket. Could. Think you can squeeze through this vent? If you can get it open, I ain't that flexible. Help us out, Drax. I am ill-suited to your task. We are meant to be clearing our fine, not adding to it. We're not breaking in, breaking in. We're concerned citizens. 
We're not citizens of Xandar, or members of Novacor. Well, whatever. We've got to deal with that tractor so we can get back to guardianing the galaxy. Yep, it's locked. Thanks for taking my work. Shut your mouth! We're supposed to be leaving. What? Groot says there's an air duct in the room with the controls. If there's one on this side, I may be able to get through. Now we have damaged Novacore property. Eh, just a little. All right, Rocket. See if this vent leads into that other room. And be careful. You know, I still don't love this whole pay or fine plan. But I gotta say, messing with some Novacore tech ain't a bad consolation prize. Huh. There's something screwy with the power grid. It's like they're on backup only. I'm singing the schematic to your visor. You could do this the whole time? Follow the circuits and let me know which junctions to switch. We'll have to pick and choose where we reroute power. We'll find out. I do not care to think of how many monsters we will need to sell to pay off this fine. We're in plain view of security and no one's come running. I guess they're not watching. That's a door. The wrong door. Hey, it's a bathroom. Anybody got to go? The only place I want to go is out of here. Oh, ho, ho. clever. But I'll bet you didn't think of this. Prepare to be amazed. Fucking right I can. This thing's got false positives all over the place. I'll have to do a relay. Is that supposed to mean anything to us? No. I just wanted you to know how difficult it is. We'll find out. Watch and learn. Oops! Oops, what? Nothing. It's fine. Maybe, uh, just don't touch. There. Fixed. Hey, that... sort of worked. The blast door is gonna need some extra juice. See if there's another power junction. Sure, I'll just hang out in the dark. Walking right, I can. Presto! What up? You know, ta-da! That is no more clear. Conspicuously silent. Good point. Hey, Nova! We want to pay our fine and get your Katrakan tracker off my ship! The Moor's right. Keep it down, Rocket. Something's off. Exactly why we should get to the Milano and go. As soon as we've paid our fine, we need to get rid of that Nova tracker. There's more than one way to shake a tail, Quill. The rodent is most qualified to speak on tails. Huh. Seems like everything was normal when Hallow's Hope showed up. Maybe that's where they are. Yeah, collectively kissing your ex's butt. I would form an extremely long queue. <laughs> Two can play that game. Or, or three. Oh, there! You hear that? Oh, poor little guy. It is a thing. Your sympathies are redundant. Out there. Hey, I'm half thing, remember? I did not. There it is again.
Uh, hey there. You are Nova. What gave it away? Whoever y'all are, come here a minute. Come on, we got the dog. Hey, jumpsuit. You gotta get me out of here. I don't belong in the cage. Nova Corps begs to differ. Well, no one asked you, scary eyes. We should not be aiding and abetting a criminal. Weren't you a Nova Corps prisoner? Indeed, and I served my time. Do you know about whatever's going on here? Not much. There was a commotion. People were talking about some mother, and then they just left. Corell? Did you see a Centurion or a little Cree girl? That's all I know. Come on, I helped you. Time to help me. Look for a door release or something. Congrats, Quill. You just executed your first prisoner. That seems improbable. What would it take to call an entire station away? Who says they were called away? Maybe they disbanded. The whole station? The whole Nova. No more cops. The galaxy would devolve into lawlessness. Yeah. Wouldn't that be great? Maybe we just sent him back to his cell. Like, that was the visit. You! Hey, buddy! Ah! Uh, whoa, hey! Oh, what now? I got rights! Now, this place brings back memories. You once served with the Nova Corps, Peter Quill. What? No! But I had to stand in a lineup once, maybe twice. <clears throat> anyway, good to be on this side of the glass. One, two, three, four. Nope. One, 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 one? Nope. Whoa, that guy was serious business. Well, now he's seriously someone else's business. Assuming that's the last we see of him. What are you doing? I figured as long as we're here, I may as well try and dig up some juicy Nova secrets. Maybe they even got a bead on Gamora's bluer half. Not likely. What's that? Nothing. It ain't spooky. That big haunted house on Dervani was spooky. I'm getting a real haunted mansion vibe from this place. Uh, elevator's out. But the shaft above looks open. We can use it to climb up there. You expect us to walk on that thing? It'll hold more than the five of us. Please don't fall, please don't fall. Run into a single Nova Corps. Perhaps they are in a meeting. Ooh, spooky. Hello. No armor. You wouldn't fit in one anyway. For real? Can I try one? <laughs> if you want to get fried to a puddle of goo, each one is gene coded by the world mind. Are you saying the world mind has the genetic code of every Nova Centurion? Yup. Word is, the bugs tried to use that against them in the war. But that's one supercomputer you can't have. Believe me, I tried. This room is austerely presented. Must be a great honor to become a Centurion. To say the least. Each Nova Prime is selected from among the Centurions. We have a similar custom among the Katafian Oracle. This looks like the only way forward. Are you blind? I didn't sign up for getting chopped in two just so you can make your, your girlfriend proud. It is more likely that the door would repeatedly crush your tiny home. Assassin, Kevin. Ah, no wonder the door is no force. 
All right, let's hope that holds. How come this one gets its own room? Looks like a workshop. You know, I hear they anodize these things with some kind of Zendarian smart metal. Metal cannot be smart. Smarter than some. Done in record time. Oof, got a crick in my back because of that. What do you think one of these suits would go for on the black market? What do you think one of these suits would go for on the black market? Don't even think about it. I I'm not gonna. I I'm just asking. There's gotta be an explanation. You heard that guy. They just left, and so should we. He also said something about Corel. He said mother. Everyone's got a mother, Quill. You do not. Point is, mother could be anyone. Except you. Uh, uh, Rocket, do your magic. No. What? I said no. When are you gonna come to your senses, Quill? I am Quill. And then what? He's gonna drag us halfway through this station if we let him. Okay, we try one more room, and if we still haven't found anything, we leave. Deal? Fine. One more room, not two. One. We ain't going back that way. I thought the Nova Corps had more ships. I heard they got, uh, staffing issues. From who? People. In places with, uh, other people. Peter Quill. I found this. Sector 1, check in. Sector 1, sweep complete. 75% acceptance rate. It is as she promised. Have faith. The promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. With faith. Well, the good news is we're not alone. There's lots of chatter. Tell them I want my ship back. My ship. I sense there's a but. But it sounds like they're searching for something or someone. Could explain why no one's around. Well, who gives a flark? Tell them to get their golden butts up here. The promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. With faith. Let's keep looking. Or we could focus on getting off this Frakakta space station. The door's flarked, remember? There's ways to unflark things, Gamora. Believe me. Bombs don't count. What about that? Where do you think that goes? Down. Good enough for me. Hey, what happened to one more room? You said the door's busted. I'm sure it's just a little further. You ain't sure a scut. I'm mostly sure. We found something, didn't we? So why the flark? Didn't you speak up? It was... weird. There was something funky about the voices on that comm channel. There they are! Something's on. not right. Oh, flark. Dishonor flark! I am Groot. <sighs> This is a mutiny. It was an execution. I ain't never seen cops kill each other. We've got to play this smart until we know what's going on. And which side survived? All right. Everyone stay low and follow me. There's something off about them. Look. They're flarking, glowing. Seems a safe bet these are the bad guys. We need a plan. should seize the element of surprise. Go! Go! 
Is down. So let's get back out there, give this fight complete dedication, and make them scream. Who's with me? Who tops field? This must is wait. Fun. Great. Flex. Set up. Destroy.
do not think our fine will be paid today. You don't say. Guys, Corell's ship is right there. We just need to... What? What do we need to do, Quill? A whole bunch of whacked out space cops just tried to vaporize us. And you want to go looking for a rematch? Because your girlfriend might be in trouble? That's not what I'm doing, and she's not my girlfriend. Could have fooled me. Rocket! The only thing that this is about is getting our ship back. We find Corell, and then none of this is our problem anymore. You're right! It won't be our problem anymore. Because we didn't sign up to be run around halfway across the galaxy by a, a cop loving human! I approve! Come on! Seriously, Corell? Join the Guardian, she said. It'll be good for your mental health, she said. <sighs> All right. Listen to Flark up. Groot and I are getting off this dast rock. Anyone who'd like a ride can follow us. Everyone else can go to hell! I prefer the rodent's plan. So tried. How long do I have to listen to you two squabbling? We're not squabbling, we're just disagreeing loudly. Besides, he started it. Rocket, come on! You come on! I told you we should have left! And we are! I'm on board! Let's find the Milano and... The intruders reported in the repair bay. And try not to die in the process. First sensible thing you said all cycle. Come on, Rocket. You can't stay mad at me. Wanna bet? Not after the last one. How about you just don't piss me off any further till we're off this Flarkin rock? Intruders in sea junctions! We're hiding our way out there! We're here to pay our fine! Tell you, Gamora! Don't stay! Send it your way, Drax! <laughs> Mom, so yes, they know we're here now! There will be none left to alert the others! Let's not wait around. Jeez, this is not where I thought this day was going. Find the invaders. None must escape. How did the all-knowing world mind not foresee this event? They're just a computer, not God. Never thought I'd be fighting Novacor again. They are no longer Novacor. Yeah, this don't count. But who or what are they? What's with that glowing? For once, let's keep our noses out of it. Secure the station. All must accept or be purged. It is Novacor's duty to protect life, not to destroy it. Tell that to the corpses in the repair bank. Corpses cannot hear. When word gets sad about this, it's gonna destroy Nova's reputation. Hey, we 
can get through here. Yo, Fit, just suck it in. Maybe Corel took her ship back to Xandar to report. Look, are they praying? What the hell have we wandered into? Check out that big guy. Don't look like no Nova to me. He's a sorcerer. Behold the magic flowing to the altar. There's no such thing as magic. Right? Come on. Let's get moving before these whack drops spot us. It's like we stumbled on some creepy cult. I told you, it ain't our problem. It will be if they've taken over Nova Corps. No Nova? No fine. No problem. We should probably tell someone. Eh, yeah, tell it to your diary. Come on, down here. How do you know? I don't. I'm just putting distance between us and those whack jobs. Any way for us to track where the hope went? Good of you to join us. What's the harm in checking? What's the harm? Oh, let's just pay our fine. Let's just look around. Let's just stumble onto a flark and cult mutiny. I am Groot. Who says I can't? This is his fault. In fact, I'm done talking to him. To who? You. Too late. Huh? Groot. Tell Mr. One More Room him and me are done. I am Groot. Fine. Quill, Groot says you and me are done. This is not productive to our egress from this station. So... So... you think... Yeah, I'll deal with the door. Someone's got to get us out of here. Whoa! Urge the faithless! Lock and stop! Can nothing go easy? Let loose, Rocket! I'm off of the ice man's dead from above! Very good, Peter Quill! Those above will die! Yeah, one of the Nova Corps nut jobs! These renegades are relentless! It'll be a slide! Like fish in a barrel! Hot to drag! Really good, Groot! This position is strategically compromised! Let's bring them down to our level! They do not seem interested, Rodin! It is best to avoid the levitating pods, Peter Quill! Beware! Stop! Don't get hit by the mine! Cut to pieces! Shields in the way! Oh, we can take him out! Peter Quill! 
I see stars! Mitsu! Nice to meet you! These bombs are making things way too crowded! The traitor must feel the front of our cooperation! Meet your maker! Get him down, Groot! I wasn't second guessing, I'm just sure. Sweep Sector 7. The intruders must be found. I knew this was a bad idea. These doors have been barricaded. It means someone at least tried to resist. Bad lot of good at them. We don't know that. There could still be others on the station. Or maybe those were the survivors who fled on Hallow's Hope. Uh, is that...? Let's just pretend we didn't see that. So, let's flark and go already! Pursue the non-believers! All must behold her gift. If these nutjobs have done anything to my ship, it's on you, Quilt. All right, Hanger, here we come. Mark with that dock number, R73-4PL. Are you serious? Always. You're my new favorite person. No, not me. There she is. Come to pocket. What's up? Alright, release the clamps and don't die! Your job! 
Guys, come the prize, on! Peter. Guys, huddle up! Long have I craved to win a battle like this, Peter Quill. Order the others to stand down so that I may finish it alone. Uh, no. If anyone's gonna win this alone, it'll be me and my blade. I am good. Dudes! We're talking about fighting alone. We're a team. We fight better together. Because out on that field, it's all for one and one for all. And that's exactly how we win this time. Who's with me? Can't wait to take him down! I am trying to destroy! Surely true number four will not fall this easily! Aww! You're gonna hurt their crazy feelings! We should set course for Contraxia. Lay bare our issues over a cold catastrophe. I don't hate it, but... We should report what we saw first, right? Because that's our biggest problem, Quill. Come on, Groot, we got Scott to do. Rocket! What's with him? The abomination is never happy. Rocket's got a point, though. Our cons are flarked, the tracker's still counting down, and Corel could be anywhere in the universe. <sighs> it's not looking good. We are in the place between hard rocks. You mean a rock in a hard place? That is what I said. Hella knows we could use a night off. So, Contraxia? We should go to nowhere instead. Ah, another suitable location to partake in liberal libations. To report what we saw. Me and Cosmo go way back. 
He's chief of security. He'll make sure the right people know about the rock. And the tracker and fine? Rocket's got a guy in nowhere. We kill two birds with one stone. Okay. I'll set the coordinates. Maybe... talk to Rocket? Peter Quill, what does killing two birds with one stone signify? You mean solving two problems with a single solution. Ha! I knew it! There are no birds on nowhere. Depends if she are count. Saw a few of them last time. Uh, I'm sorry, Drax. I thought paying her fine would make things better, but it just made things more complicated. Do not apologize, Peter Quill. Our encounter with Novacore has given me clarity of purpose. We must investigate and fight whoa, this- Whoa, whoa there, Drax. We ain't fighting Novacore if we can help it. We'll just let Cosmo handle this. The soldiers we encountered were not acting like Novacore officers. And those robed priests, it was all very disturbing. I need to clear my mind. This book is not helping. If you need a recommendation, I just finished the World Mind's postmortem on ineffective planetary scale battle tactics of the Galactic War. What part of this would help clear my mind? None. It's very upsetting to read. You're a good llama. Yes, you are. <laughs> Maybe we should check other Novacore stations to see if they're all right. Hey, uh, guys? What's up? Nothing at all, Quill. Not a thing. Uh, something wrong with Groot? Nope. He's just, uh, defoliating. Seasonal thing. Come on, I know you're lying. You guys are planning something. What we do ain't none of your business. Can't we just talk about it? Talking ain't worth scut if you don't put your money where your mouth is. Things are gonna get better, I promise. We'll fix it. Just like you promised before Seknarf? Come on, Rocket! What? You gonna tell me I'm a valued member of your crew again? Leave us alone, Quill! Do you ever ponder how different your lives would have been had you joined the Nova Corps? You asking me or Peter? Both. I don't think either of us would have fared very well. You are not fond of peacekeeping. And Peter's not fond of helmets. It messes with his hair. So those coordinates? They're in your console. Got it. Nowhere here we come. and home to the best black market deals you can find. And surprisingly good noodles. You ever wonder what kind of person found it was like, Oh look! The severed head of a giant celestial being. Let's drill holes in it and live inside. They wanted the brain tissue. Very rare. Very valuable. The marketplace came after. Along with noodles. You were certain this Cosmo is trustworthy, Peter Quill? Of course. He's chief of security. And nowhere. 
and as such probably deals in Novacore all the time. Trust me, he's gonna want to know about the rock. What are they doing back there? Shenanigans likely. See you never, flark bags! A rocket and Groot, did they really leave? Yes. It looks like it. Do we know where they went? You're the last one who talked to them. Yeah, Rocket seemed pissed off. Guess you were right. Turns out we couldn't trust those guys. I still have faith that the tree will bring the rodent to reason. At least you're still here. I wouldn't want to miss your meeting with Cosmo. Whatever. We'll talk to Cosmo and then we'll go out and have a good time. You think Cosmo will actually believe us? Like I said, we go way back. Plus, he's probably already heard about what's happening. All we do is confirm the rumor. Maybe he'll even give us a reward. I suspect the rodent and his tree companion will be drinking somewhere. Where do you get the units to afford anything? I do not expect him to pay his tab. I think it adds to the charm of the place. What about Rocky and Groot? What about them? They left. What am I supposed to do? Chase them down and beg them to come back? You could apologize. That's your advice? Apology does not need to be sincere. Then what's the point? I guess if we ever see him again. Big if, by the way. But if it happens, then maybe I might think about it. Anyway, once we let Cosmo know what's happening out there, we'll have more time to think about what to do with Rocket. If Rocket doesn't come back, we'll need a contingency plan for getting rid of the Nova Tracker. Why? We have not yet spent our ill-gotten gains. Let's get our reaction. We could still pay the fine. But we'd have to go all the way to New Xandar to do it. What if we get there and it's compromised too? There's gotta be someone shady enough in the market who can help. Maybe. The Cosmo deals with Nova Corps all the time. Maybe we can pay the fine through him. How do we find this Cosmo? We head to his tower on the far side of the market. That's where he keeps an eye on things. see Cosmo again. I guess I kind of miss the old boy. How exactly do you know him? Was he also a prisoner of the Chitauri? Nope. We met right here, back when I was in the Ravagers. Dishonorable killers and thieves. The Ravagers actually did some good during the war. Even the mangiest of mutts will behave. It befits them. Whatever bad stuff we all did is behind us. We're the good guys now. Right. Heroes for hire. Except no one will hire us. Maybe Cosmo will have a fetch quest for us or something. Well, keep an eye on your things. These coops are a bit hands-on, if you know what I mean. There were people who claimed to be able to see the future, sure. 
I've encountered them on several planets. Strange. We've got enough to worry about with the present. Soothsayers on Katath were unable to predict its demise. No one could predict what Thanos would do. Mad Titan will pay for everything that he has destroyed. He's gone, Drax. His death helped end the war. You were his adopted daughter. Can you believe that? I didn't. Not for a long time. But if Thanos was still alive, he'd have come after me by now. What are you? Do you still have those suicide allergies? What? No. Huh. And you thought joining a team would be bad for you. Hi. Sunlord, right? Is it Rockstar? It's Star Lord. Hey, that's right. I forget which version of you I've met. Did you do the thing yet? What is the thing she is referring to? No idea. Hi. I don't know if we've met yet. I'm... No. No, no, no. That's not... Oh. Oh. No, he's lying! I mean... Oh. Where the Kodajiti wrote, the broken promise of all will be mended. Less depressed. Thanks. Don't worry. It's always weird the first time. Celestial Madonna! Ah, uh, fuck. Hi, guys. You should not be in this place. Actually, I'm exactly where I need to be. <laughs> I think. No. Yes, this is where I need to be. Or needed to be. Am needed, yes. Wait, why are you here? You cannot keep leaving the sanctuary. It's not safe. There are rumblings in the galaxy. <laughs> when aren't there rumblings in the galaxy? <laughs> yeah. Okay. If you're gonna keep making that face, it was nice seeing you again, Gamora. Star guy. We mean. Okay. Bye. So, Gamora, you and Mantis seem close. We've met. Okay. You are being evasive, woman. Wait, woman? That's the nicest thing you've ever called me. Anyone ever tell you you're an open book? Hardcover or paperback? I just meant Mantis mentioned a few things. Mantis says a lot of things. They don't always make sense. Until they do. That insect woman was odd. I understand your reluctance to discuss her. Mantis is strange, but she means well. I think she does, anyway. What was his problem? Don't overthink it, Drax. Mantis gets in everyone's head. Let's get you a drink. I am not thirsty. Neither am I. Then focus on our mission and not on our mutual lack of thirst. to bring them back here? Not necessary. Transport will be waiting once you've captured the target. That'll work. We'll be in touch. Ah, let's go, Groot. What's the big idea, man? I think you got me confused with somebody else, pal. Come on, Rocket, let's talk about this. <laughs> Can you believe this guy? Oh, 
can't just quit. We need you. Oh, well, uh, I don't need you. Find some other sucker to keep your ship together. You're more than just... I know that's blown mop anywhere. Eat a queer. Uh, actually, maybe we can stick around for a bit. Last time I see you, you was running away from Mordelia. With your bridges. Off and done. Get ready for a fight. I'm always ready. What the? I don't know what's going on here. But I thought we was friends, Eta. Or did you forget about me? What? What? No, no! Man, who could forget a feast like that? <laughs> exactly. oh, this is great! This is bad! This is really bad! Remember! Ita! You and me! Star Rider! Get out of here! What is he talking about? Oh, oh, oh! I it's a song! Right? It is? Of course it's a song! The one that was playing when Peter and me made our unbreakable blood oath. We did? Unbreakable blood oath? That is a serious commitment, Peter Quill. Oh, no, 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 whoa, whoa, wait, 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 of course, I, I remember. Y you, me, uh, the, the, the music? Tells you what, Peter. How about you and me? Storm ride together! One more time. Here we go! You, uh. You're going to sing a song. Together till the end, gotta finish the fight. Cause this stone gonna rage till the end of the night. Come on, Lita! Together! Rolling like a hurricane, ride, storm, storm rider, storm rider, storm rider! Very naughty. Bartender, get me a cocktail stick. I need to poke my ears out. Come on, man. What? Let's sing the next line. More! Together till the end, now we look to the sky. Lightning strikes twice, now it's us to the fly. Sing with me, Vita. Driving through, through the, the pouring rain. Pouring rain. Ride, Ride the song. So ready. Uh, For Flark's sake, let's go, Groot. Good time, good time, good time! You running the Ravagers now? I hear Yondu's doing time in the kill. <laughs> Me? Me? No, I, I got a new crew now. You? Still doing that, uh, thing you do? No, sorry. Novacor. Now my partner on Molivia. Um, but that's okay. I, uh, got a new business partner now. Into animal husbandry. You can say. Uh, so, ain't no animal gonna have no husbands after she's through with them. <laughs> Which reminds me, I best be going. Oh, really? 
That's too bad. Ah, well, listen, Peter. I uh, want to apologize for almost shooting you. Oh, <laughs> you weren't actually going to shoot me? Oh, I would have. Uh, right in the head. Oh. But that's not the way to treat a storm rider, is it? All right, so I got you this instead. Uh, what is it? The ticket for Collector's Emporium. Yeah, I bought it thinking I'd have time to go and check out the oddities. Wow, thanks, man. That's awesome. Yeah, my pleasure. And remember... Nice one, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> Could have been worse. Where's Rocket? The rodent left the bar once he realized he would not be killed. Ah, great. some crazy things, but ghosts? <laughs> I doubt it. Cynical for me. This place brings back memories. You mean hangovers? Yep. Last time we were here, that Sakarn was no pushover. I can still taste those fermented spike eggs you made me try. Oh, remind me never to challenge you to a drinking contest. I just got back. <clears throat> I need to leave. Uh, something wrong? It's not your business, Peter Quill. Do not wait for me. Who's that? Drax! Watch it, Star Lord! Watch yourself, jerky red guy! Can you believe that? Talk to Cosmo alone. <laughs> 